Hey guys, Scott Riegers here with Eastman's Hunting Journal, and I am here today to review the Bora Vest from Cryptek. Thank you for following the reviews here on Eastman's Hunting Journal YouTube channel and our e-news and on the blog. And I wanna make sure that you subscribe to our channel so you can get more reviews like the one I'm doing today. Last year, I had the privilege of testing Cryptek's Altitude Series. And to say that I was impressed would be an understatement. At the core of this Altitude Series is the Scholar Sea Change technology. And you're probably wondering, why in the world is this dude doing a tree hugger type thing, holding a couple pine cones? Well, I'm not holding it for grins and giggles, okay? I'm holding this because Scholler took a hard look at what has God created. They, and they said, okay, this is what is in nature. We wanna mimic the way things work in nature. So sea change technology is where it opens and closes based on the climate, just like a pine cone does. So you can see how this pine cone is much tighter. You can see how this pine cone is open. When I started sweating going up the trail, this vest was opening up, letting heat out. As it was getting cooler, the vest, it closed, and so it kept, it kept and retained my body heat. I'm a huge fan of vests. Any of you who have read my reviews before on clothing know that I love having a vest as part of what I did. I had an insulation piece up on this high country trip and I love having a vest. It's just a great way for me to add some insulation at a lightweight option. This Bora vest is exactly that. And you can see because of this technology that mimics nature, it is at the top of the line from a technology standpoint. Next up, you will see that we have on this vest a great athletic fit. And I'm a big fan of this fit because I'm a big guy. And if you have looked at any of Cryptek's ad, you will see that most of them are big guys as well. And so I really enjoy that because it's a fit that really fits me well. It's a fit that doesn't feel like a, um, a five foot two model was what was used. It was actually like humans that had some size to them and I really appreciate that fit. But that doesn't mean that those of you who are on the shorter side aren't going to find that fit. They have all the sizing options that are there, but the athletic fit just fits really well, fits a variety of bodies body types and you can move in it. There's a full range of motion that you can see. I'm wearing the vest right now over the top of this Armatech Merino infused base layer. Then this Bora vest is on top of it. I could use this for most of my early season scouting trips from late August all the way into early archery season or moving into, you know, we've got a September 15th for rifle mule deer opener here in a lot of the state of Wyoming or like in Colorado where you've got some of these early high country hunts, this is, could be what you would wear for a lot of the day. You might pull your insulation or a soft cell jacket over the top, but this would be a system that would function very well and you'd be able to use it to your advantage and have a great hunt, a great comfortable hunt. So getting back into some of the creature comforts that are there. Well, you can look right here and you can see this chest pocket that I've got. It's a cell phone. Fits a cell phone perfectly. So a lot of people like to have that available because how many of us are using it to phone scope in the back country? I used it all week for this last week of scouting mule deer and having the phone scope close at the chest is nice. You know, when you're sitting and you're wanting just to have a great way to do it because pulling it out of your pants pockets is not fun. So I love having a chest pocket. So the Bora vest has that. You'll notice the cuts. You know, you can see that they're stretched there. It's not like this is made to be tight to skin. And so you can see that this is an extra large on me. You know, I'm six foot four, four and a half. And so you can see that it fits really well and tight. Not a little guy either. So you can see that I've got good range of motion with that. So that's a practical side. Now, one of the things that's a pet peeve is when we get a piece of clothing for the back country, that doesn't have zippers on every single pocket. When that doesn't happen, there might be some few choice words set around the office because we are all human and we lose things. And if we have open pockets, we're more um, likely to do that. So every one of us has lost something in the back country. And a lot of times it has to do with having pockets that don't have zippers on them in the right spots. Any jacket pocket that I have, I want it to have zippers because I usually put valuable stuff in there. 
One other thing to remember about the Cryptek Bora vest is it does have a DWR coating, nanosphere technology, where the water will flow right off the top of this. So if you get caught, every one of us has done it, get caught out in the open, one of those high country rainstorms, all of a sudden you've got a little bit of water, not an issue for the Bora vest. So some vests don't have that technology, this one does. So that is definitely a great point to remember when you're looking at the Bora vest. Two great ways to get the Bora vest from Cryptek. Number one, at cryptek.com. Number two, buy three gift subscriptions on eastmans.com and you can get this Bora vest for free. Thanks for coming along for this uh, review of the Bora vest from Cryptek. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, to our e news. And if you haven't found it yet, we'd love to have you be a part of Eastman's Tag Hub. So looking forward to this fall and we'll see you on the mountain.